cliffhanger for the win. All right. <clears throat> All right. Now there's a secret behind this boss. You have to kill the worm again, but this time you've pretty much got to um, kill him to a certain point. He'll evolve into a moth, and then you want to die. I'll go over that in a little bit. But for now, just beat the crap out of the worm, and I'll uh, pretty much uh, decide when to um, give myself up. I don't know what to call it, but lose, maybe? Alright, here's Black Shadow. Boom! Alright. Hmm. Yeah, I'd heal yourself. You want to be alive for the caterpillar form. <clears throat> Use that soul leader, hell yeah! Reponent caterpillars! Reponent caterpillars! Holy shit! Um, okay, I'll, I'll stop singing now. How do you like that? <clears throat> Clearing my throat, biatch. Alright, now he'll evolve into this big ugly moth thing with a huge stinger on it, which is contradictory because moths don't have stingers. But anyway, what you want to do is just defend. Just die. Ouch! Ouch! A double take! No! Damn it, that was mean. So how a caterpillar can go past the cocoon stage right into a moth stage is beyond me, but it's video game logic for you. Uh-oh, he's gonna drop him on his head. Boof. 80. Uh-oh. Nami might be the first one to go. Yep, done. <clears throat> Kill me! Kill me, come on! Kill me! Kill me! Take me out of my misery! Boom! Alright. Of course, no one can kill Ryu, he's invincible. Aw, oh, crap! I'm glad he showed this move, I was getting ready to worry. He was gonna, wasn't gonna show it. Ah, you still didn't kill him. Haha! Come on, fool. Bonk. Yeah. We're dead, guys. Oh, noes. <clears throat> Whatever are we going to do? Young Master! We're done for if we stay here. We've got to take Ko and get out of here. Are you okay, Young Master? Ryu! Ugh. I hate doing that voice, really, I do. But it's so damn funny. Yeah, don't mess with people with true runes. Or in Ryu's aspect, or Ryu's uh, thing, is actually an aspect of the true rune. So, whatever. Just die! <clears throat> Alright, Tear, time for your judgment. Oh fuck yes, this is epic. Done. Yep, and in order to do that you have to die. Yeah. <clears throat> well how about that? This is one of the only rare circumstances that death can actually benefit you. Unless if you're playing like... A uh, platformer or something. And, like, 
if you have no lives and if you can respawn everybody. Anyway, we're going to take Ko to Greg Minster. So that means that Tyr is going to have to face all of those people that he saw in Sweet Code and 1. Or recruited, rather. Not all of them, but most of them. Not even most of them. Damn it, I can't even think. <laughs> anyway, let's just run back to Greg Minster. Oh, we're already here. I thought it was going to be longer. Varkus. Who's actually, we all know that he was a former star of Destiny. Lord Tickdoll! It's Lord Tickdoll! <clears throat> Varkus is poisoned! Alright, I understand. I take you to Greg Minster as fast as I am able! Tickdoll! Gotta love that. Ah, game glitch for the win. And here is Lucan, who witnessed the final moments of Master Matthew. This is home, I make my living. Uh, yeah, that makes a lot of sense. Yay, I bet you are Lapont. The office of president has always been rightfully yours. Please come this way. Aw, Tyr doesn't want to. But I don't wanna! <laughs> they should have made us choose that again. That would have been awesome. I would have been on the floor laughing. Yeah, Lapont does have a point, but, but, <clears throat> but he doesn't wanna. Sorry. I guess Eileen is right there. <clears throat> My throat feels really bad. <sighs> An airless room. At least the floors are shiny. But I don't wanna. Lord Tick Dole. I know there are people waiting for you. <clears throat> oh yes, there are. And what's really cool is that you're able to wander around now, which is one of the cool things I like. Here's another uh, tip of the hat to one of the generals, Kasim Hazil. Even though we don't get to see him, that would be awesome if we got to again. Like all of the generals. <clears throat> All right, here's an interesting uh, room. Whoops. Tick Dole, leader of the Liberation Army. He has a little statue there. Even his clothes are there. It looks like Grimio's hatchet and his staff are there too, but I think they're all replicas. You'd think they'd stuff these rooms with more stuff, but... Mm. All right, now if you talk to this guy, you can get the copper hammer, but I already got it, so... Yeah. <clears throat> Sorry, guys. Hey, it's Pawn! Young Master! Sorry I had to kill your father back then, but it's been such a long time. I'm so glad to see you. I just had a feeling you'd be back. So I came home as well. Yep, Pawn is broke. Broke hobo. That would be cool. They should release like a game called The Chronicles of Tear. And it'll be like his entire life, like after liberating uh, <clears throat> the Scarlet Moon Empire. Huh? Okay. That is freaking cool. Come on, guys, you gotta admit that was awesome. I was in Tio's chair. Tio's chair, man. That is honor. Ah, I remember this room. This room was the start of my very long journey way back when. Well, it wasn't way back when, but. <clears throat> Last year, I suppose. Don't wanna rest. Now, you can unlock extra dialogue if you bring Kasumi here. So, I didn't choose her again, I chose Valeria. 
<clears throat> Personally, because I really don't like Kasumi as a character, but... Yay, Cleo likes us. We're popular. <clears throat> I'll protect you, young master. Oh, that is sweet. Ooh, can I tickle you again, Grimio? Aw, oh, damn it. <clears throat> again, they should give us the options to tickle Grimio when we can. Oh, well. At least he's making some stew. <clears throat> 